How's the first six months at, at USC been? It's been good. You know, there's been a, it's been a lot of change fast, mm -hmm. but spring went good. It felt like the guys got better each day. Um, we just started picking back up with the guys this past week. Um, so we're excited about the direction that the mm -hmm. team's going, and we're just prepared for camp right now. Yeah. What? Uh, take me back to... Um, when you got the phone call from Lincoln Riley, mm -hmm. you were at UCLA to come be the defense coordinator here, you know, such a prestigious elite program. Uh, what was it about, you know, what did he say to you that made you want to want to make the jump? You know, he didn't have to say much, <laughs> you know, um, I grew up a huge college football fan. Mm -hmm. And when you just think about college football programs, it doesn't matter what part of the country that you're on, you know, one of the first programs you think of is USC. Yeah. And despite all the Heismans that are in this building, I still think of defense. Mm -hmm. Some of the best defensive yeah. players ever to play in the NFL were on that practice field. Mm -hmm. So to get a chance to be a part of the tradition and history in a program yeah. like this at this time, going into the Big Ten, mm -hmm. um, it was something I did not want to yeah. turn down at all. Uh, take me through your first unit meeting, first defensive unit meeting. You're installing your defense. What's mm -hmm. kind of like the principles or the culture or wh what are you telling the, your defense about this is what we're going to be on defense mm -hmm. from a culture standpoint? The biggest thing I try to say to the guys is, you know, the scheme is flexible. We're always going to mm -hmm. put the guys in the best position. But more importantly, it's not about the scheme. It's about how we do it. Yeah. And that's just something I've been lucky enough to coach for different DCs where you know, we've done stuff drastically mm -hmm. different ways and had success still. Yeah. So um, scheme is scheme. At the end of the day, it's about how you do it and how are you getting those guys to execute your scheme. Yeah. So it's a more about how we play. Yeah. I was just talking to Coach Henderson as you were walking in about, you know, as, as elite as this program has been for a long time, mm -hmm. the one area recently that hasn't been as elite, at least the perception actually has been the defense. Is there anything that you've done specifically to kind of like flip that culture or that mindset or kind of, you know, build that to, you know, ultimately end that narrative? Um, we just want to be as process oriented on yeah. our side of the ball as we can. You know, we know what the outside's saying. We know um, what the expectations are. I had the same mindset I had when I got the job at UCLA. Mm -hmm. You know, I don't care what the defense was ranked last year. Mm -hmm. Let's get better and better each day. And let's be better next year than we were last year. Yeah. All right. Then let's be better the next year than we were the year before. Let's just keep on getting better. Mm -hmm. And if we just have that mindset, you know, we're going to like where we end up.